My friend Lucy is here <laughs> and uh, she saw my House of CB order and she was like, can I try that? You've been thinking of buying this for a while, yeah, right? Yeah, I have. I really like this stuff. Do you, have you been thinking of buying it since you saw my video? Perhaps. <laughs> oh, you look like a princess. Wow. It's cute. Oh, it's lovely. I think it looks cute. This dress is just flattering on absolutely everyone. Yeah. Like, it is just the best dress that's ever been made. Sorry, strawberry dress who? Oh, you have to get one for yourself. Ah, oh, maybe. Hi, baby. Hi. Excuse me, can I sit here? Make some room, please. Who's me? <laughs> Who's me? The Selena off the shoulder long oh. puff sleeve mini dress in the shade Celery. That is the most unflattering shade name I've ever heard. I like life. Celery and I like this here. I hate Celery, but I like this. Ooh, ooh. It's very slippery. Uh, in the pictures, it looked really, really nice. I paid $64 for it. Hmm. And are they fake buttons? Yeah. Yes, they're fake buttons, which is back. not a bad thing because in another video, they were all real buttons and I was like, it keeps popping open. Struggle. Oh, it's so cute. I think this will look really cute on and it's yeah. got um, nice grip tape as well. Oh, grip so tape. So it's going to stay nice and oh, like a little rubbery bit on the top. Without putting it on, I think that that's totally worth $64. Look, it's got a double layer and each piece of fabric is like really thick. Oh, that's pretty. You like this? That's nice. That I don't so, like it. You don't like it? No, I'm not that happy with it. It's actually, it's very tight. Oh my god, it's so tight at the top. I mean, it's technically my size, but also I feel like I would have to size up. The concern is, do I size up and then risk it? Because, oh my god, it's very tight. If I sized up, I feel like it may not have enough grip here and it may fall down. Not a huge fan. It's very small. And it's very tight, and while I love the sleeves, and I love the colour, and I love the fabric, I don't mind it so much when I pull the shoulders down, but that's not how it's intended to be worn. I think the shoulders are supposed to be up. Yeah, no, I, I don't really want to keep this one. I think I'll send this one back. This is one of those disappointing moments where I had such high expectations. It was like my favourite thing from the order, and now that it's here, it's my least favourite thing. <laughs> this, okay, did this come as a set? I mean, it didn't come as a set, but you ordered both. Ah, uh, yes, the leggings. Luna Fluffy Leggings in Baby Blue, $32. And the top is Stella Fluffy Round Neck Long Sleeve Crop Top in Baby Blue, $16. Yeah, these are both on sale. That's great, $16. Yeah. That's fine. That's really cute. This is really soft. Mm -hmm. And they lovely. have that in the green and the pink as well. Yeah, okay. I really like the top. Reserving judgment on the pants because last time I wore fluffy pants, it uh, wasn't that flattering. Yeah. So interested to see how these look. Yeah, sometimes the fluffy pants can add a bit of bulk, but this is like a... Fancy fluffy. Fancy fluffy. You know when you get the like the ones that are like really chunky fluffy and it just makes you look like you're wearing like a sheep costume or a telly tubby. Okay, this one, I think this is actually your pick because this is a small, but this is also a small. I probably do a medium in the legs because they're just like tiny bit see-through at the back, but it's really comfy. I don't feel sweaty and gross, which is like all I can hope for in loungewear. I just want to feel like cute, but comfy, but not sacrificing the comfy for the cute. Some fluffy things like this, I think are a bit cheap feeling, but this actually does feel really nice. And I love the color, the baby blue. Oh, is beautiful. It looks pretty. so nice on you. It's nice when I have pink hair. Yeah, I do like it. <laughs> I am Sully from Monsters Inc. That's, that's all I'd like to say. I just want, I want to live in this forever and never take it off. I'm just going to turn into a hairy little blue gremlin and never leave the house and just live in this forever. Oh, you picked this one. Did I? Yeah. Why did I pick this? this what do you not, mean, why did you pick this? This is not something I would wear. This you is... don't have any recollection of our order that we did at 1am? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? Yeah, we, we ordered this stuff at like 1am, 2am this morning and it turned up at 2pm. Yeah. It oh, was very fast they really, turnaround. They were like they the same hard. day and I was like, same day, sure. But they were like, no, it's actually the same day. day. Uh, this one is the Sienna Sleeveless Ribbed Midi Dress in White and it was $90. This is Lux. Does it feel that? It's it's nice. It's nice. I, I'm not wowed by it, but I, I like am. it. I'm yeah. wowed by it just because when I've tried to buy rib knit things in the past, I, I this is what I wanted, mm. but it, much thinner things turned up. So yeah. this actually feels very nice. They have a really good reputation for basics. Everyone that I've ever asked about mesh key has always been like, the basics. That's kind of why I've never really shopped on there, because I'm like, I don't want basics. I don't want basics. <laughs> yeah, I want, I want pastels and rainbows. I'm already basic. I need something more cool. Yeah. Than that. Cool. Well. I don't, I'm not the biggest fan. You don't like what it? What shoes do I wear? <laughs> Those are, it looks nice. Oh, there's something on the bottom of it. It's already got like a yeah, smudge. Yeah, I noticed that when we pulled it out of the ah. box. It's got a smudge. So I feel, I think someone probably tried it and returned it and yeah. got it a bit dirty. I don't know. I, it looks lovely on thank you. Thank you. It really like really hugs your figure really nicely. You look really pretty in it. Thank you. You look so fancy. 
This is like textbook. This is textbook Australian Instagram. It goes to the races, like Brooke Hogan yeah. or Georgia. What's the Georgia Gibbs? <laughs> I don't know who these people are, but sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could find like a long cardigan or a turtleneck or anything else skirt, a pencil skirt made exactly with this meshki ribbed knit because this is. So nice. It's it so looks soft. really pretty. And also, I, I like this color. It's not quite dark white. No. It's like a little bit off. I do like a, it, a but. Green, perhaps? Or an ivora? 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 I don't think I'll keep this. I think I'll return like this. I like it. I think you should keep it. You look really pretty in it. I, do, I hate things that are so tight that yeah, you just feel I, conscious I, the I whole time. That. If you're into styles like this, this is actually, without a doubt, like one of the nicest rib knit dresses I think I've ever tried. I think it feels lovely. <laughs> this is so cool. We say which in the most basic outfits of the 2000s. <laughs> That's hot. This amber cropped drill jacket, $53, and okay. it's matching pants. Uh -huh. The Leah black zip denim pants, yeah. $60. You are really keen on these. I'm very keen to try I them think on. These are cool. This is like early 2000s vibes. I really like contrast stitching, and the copper detail is cute. Oh, too. copper. Yeah, it's like rose gold. Yeah, that's wow. Cute. This is promising to me. The jeans aren't the sort of length I would normally like, they're a little bit cropped. Could be nice though. Mm. Feels really good. Yeah, that's feels a nice. good price actually for this that. It's quite out of left field for something I would order, but I'm excited to see you in it because I think it'll suit you a lot. Mm. Oh dear, I just went to try on these pants and there's a zip at the back but there is nothing to pull the zip up and down with and it also looks really really scuffed and damaged. I have a sneaking suspicion someone's worn this and uh, damaged it a bit because the pull tab is missing and it's all sort of damaged up here. Oh dear. This is unfortunate because I quite literally cannot undo it. I tried sticking things in it and I tried pulling down, I put a bobby pin through it, I tried to pull. I'm very gutted. I think I would have really liked these. Yeah, it's hard to really say how much I would like this when I'm not wearing it properly. If I was wearing the pants properly with a pair of high heels, I'd be able to gauge mm. how much I like it. Quality feels nice, but it's a bit disappointing. The, the fact that the pull tab on the zip is broken off says to me maybe it's not the best quality hardware on these pants. Mm. I think it's cool. I don't love it. Yeah. I'm not obsessed with it. I think it's just okay. It's a shame. Yeah. Oh, oh this oh. one. You were so upset. You were like, the black dress, we must get the black dress. And I was like, valid. But is this meant to be nightwear? Is this a No, nightwear? it's meant to be a slip dress, like 90s style, because it's from their like 90s collection. So uh, this is the Elizabella lace trim side split midi dress, and it was $70. Now that it's here, this seems like pajamas you'd get from Peter Alexander. If you guys saw that thrift video that I posted when I got, as people told me, the maternity nightgown that I didn't realize was a maternity nightgown. Anyway, I thrifted that. In the pictures, it didn't look like a nightgown. Gown, but just holding it, I'm like, yes, I would wear this to bed. I think on it's gonna look a lot more. I hope so. Yeah. Also, that... I think it looks really nice. I'm like more positive on this than you, I think. $70 is a lot for this. This is the first no, thing. No, it feels so nice. Do you think? Yeah. Oh, okay. It's nice, it's got a nice weight to it, which means it'll lie nice. Okay, this is a lot. This is a uh, way more Pretty. than showing way more than I'd ever really feel comfortable wearing. Okay, Angelina Jolie. <laughs> Yeah, it's very like Bond villains, you know, love interest or like Angelina Jolie in that, what was that movie where she's a spy and her husband? Oh, Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Yeah. Yeah, I think she wears something exactly like yeah. that. It looks great. It's nice. It, yeah. <laughs> like you said, it does feel like it's made quite well. It's got an interesting layering here. It's got this really plush, thick kind of fabric on the inside, a really nice thick fabric, and on the outside is a mesh. And then it's just, that's, I don't think I could go out comfortably wearing this because I would just constantly be like, it's a little out of your comfort zone, but you do look really good in it. Thank you. If you like these sort of dresses, I think you'd be very happy. It was a little bit pricey, but also I think it's a nice cut. It's a little cut. black dress. It is it, a little black dress. It can stay dress. in your wardrobe for a very long time. And it's a very classic cut. Like it's a 90s inspired cut, so you know it's gonna be timeless. Timeless. Okay, yeah. It... <laughs> Bye. This, See. God, this heinous, th I don't know. <laughs> why, Lucy, why? <laughs> This is the. It's so funny. The Brielle cutout side it's long so sleeve mini dress. Sixty two dollars. Well, cutouts are really in at the moment. Yeah, you know, cut your trendy. kidneys out. Yeah, they, <laughs> someone on the black market stole your kidneys and they took half your clothes with them. Ew. You're like walking down the street and they're like, they took your kidneys because they could see them. Yeah. And you're like, please don't blame me. Yeah, this is um, that's cursed. I don't. Also, I, I don't like this fabric. I it's think like it's very club wear. It's super club wear. I'm yes. in my early twenties. I still have some life force remaining to go to the club. It's cursed, but 
I, it's cursed. I ordered it for entertainment because I am not entertained. It's so funny, and it might look good, but probably not. But it's funny. Wow. <laughs> All right. I don't think it looks that good. I think there are other things that flatter me a lot more. It's not as heinous as I thought it would be. No, no, it's not as much of a like actual war crime. I think. <laughs> But would I choose it out of a lineup of like cute cocktail dresses? Probably not. Give us a spin. Oh, it does look. It looks really nice on you. You look great. <laughs> you look lovely. <laughs> I think it's okay. I picked it because it's weird, and I wanted to see what it was like. And now I know. And now I know that I'm okay. I don't need it. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, get it. Heinous. Heinous. I hate it. <laughs> it looks better on you than it does on me. I think. You're not really giving it a fighting chance, are you? <laughs> oh, I got oh. pajamas! Yeah, these are so cute. This is the Isabella satin pajama pants in pistachio, fourteen dollars, and the Abigail satin pajama top, fifteen dollars. Mm. I really wanted some luxe. Actually, you influenced me to want pajamas like this. Wait, you, really? But you have some really nice, like, silky kind of pajamas that you wore in an Instagram photo a really long time ago. <laughs> you were like sitting in a hotel room on a bed. And like, was I? Yeah, I'm sure. I have no recollection of this, but cool. I'm sure. I think I have something kind of like this. I'm sure so maybe... I've seen you wearing like silky satiny pajamas, and, and I was like, that looks really nice. And like, you just want to go to a hotel and get your breakfast and sit on the bed and take one of those influencer style photos because you actually sit on the bed and drink your orange juice. <laughs> I, I really like pajamas like these. I think when we were looking at them, I was like tempted, but I personally become a very sweaty wench. And this is like sweat city to me, but sweat they are really cute. Well, really I'm, cute. I don't become a sweaty wench because yeah, I'm you, freezing cold every you don't day. You sweat night. like at no, all. I don't. It's crazy. <laughs> I sweat like a little bit, but I overheat in certain pajama types because I'm high maintenance. You know, this is everything I hoped for. This is quite literally exactly what I wanted it to be. When I saw it on the website, I was like, I hope it feels like this, and I hope it looks like this. And it does. Actually, I think it feels better, and I think it looks better. I am so ready to sit on my couch with a hot chocolate and my laptop and just work from home and just relax and watch Netflix. Oh, this is so nice. You're the fanciest woman at the hotel. The color, pistachio? That's a cute shade name, not like celery. A uh, pistachio. I like celery. I hate celery. It's a really sweet color. And also, these are extra small pants. I would normally wear, well, I, I go between an extra small and a small, but I was kind of concerned that they'd be too tight, but they have stretch in the back of them. They've got this like stretchy thing. So the size is pretty flexible. Whether you go one size up or one size down, I think you'd be okay. Oh, I love this. I'm ready to cut my dog in bed. He's like, Wah. <laughs> the last things, so I've got my tracksuit velvet jacket, $25 in baby blue, and then the matching pants, which were $19. Lucy's wearing the Regina velvet tracksuit in yes. pink. The pants were 34, so for some reason they were more expensive than mine, but they feel they the, feel they feel the same. same. They're both really nice. Your top was 34 as well, but mine was 25. But that's that's the, the same pink thing. It's because it's uh, got Regina in the name. They've got to pay for that trademark that they didn't pay for. <laughs> that's all the stuff that we ordered from Meshki. I love this, can I just say? Our track suits. Show oh, them the buttons. The, <gasps> the details. Yeah. This is, uh, when I unboxed this, I was like shocked. When you unzip it, the diamantes mm. are on both sides of the zip. So and then when you pull cute. it up, they just like link together. Oh, it's so cool. And then it's on cute. the back, what do we say? I think what? it says obviously. The mm. tops say obviously. Where and are our bums? The pants say peachy. <laughs> oh, we forgot something. Oh, we did. We, <laughs> hang on, wait, wait. Don't forget the most important part. Oh, can I just say the tags are really cute too? Isn't that it cute? <gasps> it's a Motorola Razor! I wanted this phone more than I wanted to live. <laughs> these are cute, and we both look really cute in these. I think they're really comfy, they're cute, and they're just like campy, like a bit of camp. <laughs> okay. okay, so here's the full length of our tracksuits. They're kind of tight, but- They are a little bit tight. But... They're so comfy! Oh my god. They're really this actually, is... they feel so nice. Normally with velour, it feels like sweat city. Yes. And it's quite warm in here. It's You've really got the warm. good, good heat and in the Sydney winter, I appreciate it. But I'm like feeling, I'm not overheated at all. Fits nicely. It's comfy. It's comfy. It's comfy. I looked at yours and your little heels and I was like, I should take off my Ugg boots. Ugg boots aren't fetch. <laughs> So, pockets, lovely, high-waisted, which I mm -hmm. very much appreciate. Me too. I love the little cropped sweater. I would have liked these more if these were wide leg pants, personally. Yeah, I wouldn't mind like a straight cut, but for me personally, straight cut or flare cut pants can be hit or miss. But a legging, at least I know what to expect with a legging. I want to do the same pose as you. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of a 
vibe. It's a vibe. I really like it. Yeah. Can I tell you a funny story? The yeah. last time I wore a velour tracksuit, it was a hot pink velour juicy oh. couture tracksuit. Oh. And I wore it skiing. Oh. oh my god, I'm so jealous. And I wore it unironically too. I was that's, like, I'm hot shit. I think that's the only way you can wear it. That's <laughs> iconic. Like, this is giving me, I've actually talked about how much I live for the juicy tracksuit. And this is actually like giving me that fantasy. But it's nicer than the juicy tracksuits. I've owned those juicy tracksuits and these are nicer. I'm really <laughs> cute. I'm really impressed with We both cute. look cute. I'm so I'm gonna impressed. go ahead and say it. I'm not afraid to say it. We both look cute. We also got this red dress, which we forgot about because it was left on the hanger over there. Because you want to tell them why? Oh yeah, so when I was pulling stuff out of the box, this one's bag was red and blotchy and stained. So like the color of this, I think rubs or runs. So I was like, let's not put it near anything else. But it looks really pretty. This was $150. That's the most expensive thing we got. They have it in three different colors, and I think it was one of the most loved things on their website. Yeah, it was, it was, yeah. it was one of the like kind of best sellers, so we figured we should probably try it. it. Mm. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, don't don't touch it against anything because uh, it rubs off. Probably needs to be washed. Though. Yeah, I think <laughs> if you do one wash on its own, it would maybe be okay. Hopefully. But, wow. Uh, hmm. Wow. Uh, so I'm pretty sure that this dress may be outlawed in certain states uh, and territories. I think the color's really nice. <laughs> Red. <laughs> it's it's a nice colour. It gives you that like, you know, with the pink hair, it's like the Valentine aesthetic that oh, Millie gosh. from Marshmallow Gals and I, we both really like that. I'm holding my hands here because um, essentially it's a leotard with this sheer thing over it. Um, you'll be able to see in the picture, that's what it, oh, you'll be able to see in the picture <laughs> that that's what it looks like. And obviously I'm wearing undergarments today so I can try these things on. But uh, the leotard is, it's right up in there. It should have a sticker on it that says you can't return this after trying it on. <laughs> because it's, it's right up there. I'm fully covered, so do not be afraid. I've taken the proper precaution. I, I will rotate, but Alex is now going to put a Gaussian blur because it's essentially entirely sheer. I think if I got the size up, we might have a better chance at some level of modesty. Alex can see, but you can't, but it's um... I'm allowed to look. <laughs> I'm privileged enough to look. It's, I think it's a cute idea for a dress, but if it was like a little slip, I think instead, like a really short slip with the sheer over it, I would maybe like it. But I think that's meant to be what it's meant to be. I think you look amazing, but yeah, it's Thank a you. lot. It's, it's a lot. It's a lot. I think if you want something really dramatic, really drama, really glam, um, I think if you watch like the MTV Music Awards or something like that, we can kind of get away with wearing something a bit racy. And you know what? I kind of stand the provocative racy vibe. I just don't have anywhere where I personally can wear this. I just feel like my cheeks would get a little chilly in this winter. The, it's the, so nice. The, the still, shape. Oh wow, that booty! You look yeah. amazing. Well, yeah, but you can um, wear, wear it for your boyfriend. Yeah, have yeah. Have a Valentine's Day dinner at home. <laughs> yeah, I mean it's it's June, so <laughs> got a while to wait. Um, I think it looked a bit better on you than it looks on me. Alex, you didn't um do up the bodysuit. Oh, okay, rude. You look so good. My goodness. I feel like I don't belong on YouTube. <laughs> I belong on a different website. I don't hate it, but yeah. also I could never. Power to you if you could. If you could go out wearing something like that. Power to you. Iconic. Where do you wear something like this and like how do you feel? Because I would just be like, oh yes, I'm walking to the restaurant and everyone is looking at my bum. Even though what you're seeing right now, that's not my skin, that's my Spanx actually. So hey YouTube, uh... nothing inappropriate here. Thank you very much. Sorry Susan. <laughs> Sorry Susan, not today. If you like this sort of thing I think you would be so happy with it it's actually really cool and it feels very comfortable too like it's sometimes when you get these really tight dresses they're so tight that they feel uncomfortable but it feels very yeah it feels stretchy enough like I can move my legs I'm not sort of like like this I can get a full stride out of this I can run from the people that are staring at me it's maybe worth the 150 maybe also it's not a huge amount of fabric for that sort of money but I would say maybe it is worth it if you like this sort of thing go for it but I can I put this in the thumbnail without getting demonetized you do swimsuits and thumbnails right it's more covered than a swimsuit it is more covered than a bikini mm -hmm. and my last bikini haul didn't get demonetized so if this one does I have some questions for Susan <laughs> Obviously we can't forget dearest Lockie down here. He's an icon. We had to get something for him, but unfortunately what we got for him did not quite fit. We got, for my blue velvet tracksuit, we got the matching doggy jumper, which says fetch in Diamantes. Hi buddy. Hey, I've got something for you. It's your colour, it is. I think you might be a bit too chunky. Look at your little nose. Hey Bobby. Oh Lockie, I think you're too big. This is a medium. Are you really a large dog? 
apparently has three options. I think he's just fluffy. Fluffy, I'm so sorry. I don't want to choke him. Is this too tight? Oh no, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> he's only okay, choking. Fine. <laughs> Silence, puppy. <laughs> okay, you know what? That's hot. <laughs> oh, Bubby. Doesn't fit. But hang on, maybe if we go feetsies first. Can I have this, please? Thank you. Okay, right. We're in there. And then... I've done this wrong. Whoops. <laughs> wow, Lucky, I think you need a large. You, I know, a little bit too big. <laughs> Not meshy body shaming your dog. <laughs> <laughs> One more try. Oh, here we go. Oh, oh, oh yeah, he fits the medium. Oh, sorry. He keeps slipping. The velvet is so slippery. Look, he's like, I'm the man of constant sorrow. That's hot. <laughs> okay, no, let's get him out of this. Sorry, we'll release baby. you, King. Sorry, baby. How do we get you out? It was twenty dollars, which is. That's, That's fine. fine. Totally fine. But it's called the Gretchen Dog Jumper. <laughs> it comes in three sizes. The sizes available are called small, medium, and large. I thought to myself, Lockie's not the biggest dog in the world. Uh, maybe I'll get him a small. And I was like, no, a small would be a Chihuahua or a Pomeranian. So I'll go for the medium because a large would be like a German Shepherd, right? Wrong. Interestingly, there is a size guide. And when you click on the size guide, see it goes into inches, bust, waist, and hips. And I was like, <laughs> How do I measure a dog's bust? <laughs> At what point, where does the bust begin and the hips end? So uh, you're I, just curvy, Lockie. You're like a you're like a fashion over model. Yeah. I got him a medium and it did not fit in the slightest. I'm I sorry, Meshki's body shaming you. Can I just say, as I stayed here, that Lockie is the sweetest dog I've ever met in my life. Thank you. It's so cute. I think the video where I introduced Lockie, I think a lot of people missed it because it was like a thrift video and yeah, not many people kind of watched mixed it. In. Lockie is my dog that I got in 2011 and he's been living with my parents and now that Dan and I have bought a house we have brought him to live with us. He was really unwell when we got him because he developed an allergy and he was really sick. I brought him here and I took over all the vet fees and everything because it was like a really big burden on my parents having to pay thousands of dollars for his vet fees. But he's back on track now, he's so oh, he's healthy. So He's so healthy and he's so happy to be here and we love him and we, baby. we take him everywhere with us. But uh, obviously Meshki only wants to uh, dress two hours, obviously. So <laughs> I'm sorry, baby. Don't take it personally. You're still so fetch, Lucky. So fetch. That's it, guys. That's everything. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to subscribe to Lucy, her channel is in the description down below. And we're going to be filming another video oh, now. Yes. We ordered Meshki mystery boxes. Yes, they had like surprise box for the end of financial year sale and I was like, hmm, a mystery you say. We have so, no idea what's in them, nope. but we're gonna try them out on her channel. So if you wanna see those weird mystery items, <laughs> there's a link in the description box below. And with that, thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Mwah!